press. Step 2. Sharpen the flutes. Now you are ready to sharpen the primary edges of the flutes. You sharpen the flutes from the shank to the end. Thread the end mill onto the stylus until the shank is as close to the stylus as possible. Turn on the motor and advance the feed knob until the wheel lightly touches the end mill. Then advance one to two graduations more. Note that each increment of the feed knob represents two one thousandths of an inch in movement. Sharpen by slowly pulling the end mill away from the wheel until it comes off the stylus. Push the clearance handle down and thread the next flute on the stylus. Slowly release the clearance handle and again pull the end mill until it comes off the stylus. Repeat this process for each flute. Now, sharpen the secondary clearance angle. You do not always need to sharpen the secondary geometry. The primary cutting edge should be one quarter the width of the entire land. Only sharpen the secondary when the primary cutting edge is too wide, more than one half the width of the land. Move the stylus into the secondary position by loosening the knob and rocking the fixture up and back as far as possible. Sharpen the secondary as you did the primary cutting edge. Thread the end mill onto the stylus as close to the shank as possible. Move the feed knob into the secondary until it touches. Then pull until the end mill comes off the stylus. Then push down the clearance handle, reposition, release the handle, and repeat until the secondary clearance angle on all flutes have been sharpened. 